Hi, this is Dr. Saxena and uh, the very uh, uh, interesting few things which uh, help you in restoring your health as well as uh, trying to do that prevention of uh, getting, uh, you need to think of uh, some of the th simple things which can be, uh, everyone should be aware of. Uh, the most important, uh, this is one of the, sim I'll be talking some simple me methodologies, but you need to know uh, showering when we when we go to a shower when we take a bath if we are not really careful you are you may increase the risk of cancer uh, because of the showering let me explain how this happens it is basically uh, people tend to go for warm showers uh, hot water showers and uh, what happens during this is when your water, the, uh, the kind of water we use has got something like chlorine in that. Uh, chlorine, uh, we, it has been used since years and all. And uh, there are a lot of uh, other heavy metals also. Uh, when you take this hot shower, this chlorine in the water because of that heat and all during that. So it changes into something like chloroform. It changes into carbon tetrachloride. These are all the chlorination products of this uh, this particular stuff. With the uh, so, what happens is you are taking a shower. You are uh, with the warm shower. Your skin the temperature goes up slightly, and there is a thing called whenever there is an increased temperature with a hot shower, there is a happens is a vasodilation. Uh, cold uh, water or when we apply cold uh, ice packs to any cut because it there is a vasoconstriction which happens. Vasoconstriction of the, con of the blood vessels they constrict. Whereas with the warm water, the blood vessels dilate. When this blood vessels dilate and you have got chloroform and all this uh, things and all that, it gets into the skin very easily. Apart from that, you are inhaling the vapors also. So 50 to 60 percent of this inorganic chlorine in the tap water in the hot showers rises to chloroform and which is inhaled. That's the reason you have to have a very uh, hot bath of showers, you feel dizzy, you feel like sleeping. Uh, it is nothing but it's a chloroform kind of stuff. But now we have reasons. <laughs> There's a kind of uh, studies which we have done. I can always uh, quote one of the doctors who has done uh, William Reed some. So he has shown taking hot shower, getting into cancer. So be careful what you are trying to look into that because we somewhere we are the places where we are we don't have that shower filter with us but i'm talking particularly india people doesn't have that concept so uh, try to sit, stay away from this hot showers and uh, try to be healthy uh, 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 that i think uh, this is one of the simplest uh, preventive uh, kind of stuff which we can always uh, share with uh, uh, people and uh, see that uh, I remember my grand uh, uh, mother telling me that if you bathe, if you bathe with cold water uh, you are more healthy and I think that is true uh, instead of this all hot showers and all that I make it very clear sure I don't go into that kind of hot kind of things because if you see properly when you do that hot shower all the fumes they uh, the fumes even the, the mirror gets uh, condensed I uh, think kind of uh, this one fox uh, appear over that and uh, this is uh, one thing which everyone has to be careful while taking a simple as simple thing like a bath thank you